can confirm to you that there was no weapon, arrow, one gun, 3,000 guns, or any number of weapons in my house or anywhere that I know that were purchased by anybody that I know to harm anyone. I can confirm to you that I know of nobody or group of people or network of individuals who planned violence against anyone. I can also confirm to you that I attended no fundraising or any form of raising money to buy anything to harm anybody. And therefore, there was no way this case would go any other way unless anybody could tell me that because there was loss of life and destruction of property in our country, which we all admit, somebody needed to pay for it, even if they were innocent. And therefore, I want to say without fear of any contradiction that the allegations that were made against me were criminal acts of evil minds that schemed, connived, polluted and fabricated a case against us. I have searched my conscience and my soul and I have chosen that all those who gave false testimony against me, I have chosen to forgive them. And it is my prayer that the same God who has vindicated me will help them come to terms with their acts. As for those who colluded and conspired and connived to manufacture and fabricate a false evil narrative and went ahead to hire and bribe and coach witnesses so that this case can be brought against us, it is my prayer that the same God who has vindicated me 
will help them come to terms with their evil acts and help them bring them to repentance so that they can account for their acts. They know themselves, individuals, civil society groups, all manner of organizations is my prayer that one day God will help them so that they can repent and account for their acts. Lastly, I want to thank in a very special way my friend and brother Uhuru Kenyatta, the president of Kenya, for believing in me, for working with me, and encouraging me all the way as I went through this ordeal. I commit that under his leadership we will work towards bringing Kenya together, working with all communities from all regions and every faith. Harnessing our collective efforts in making sure that we have a united, harmonious, reconciled, prosperous Kenya. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you.